A private workplace dispute over reading material could interest much of the Canadian public because, as our senior investigative correspondent Diana Swain uncovered, the workplaces in question are some Air Canada cockpits. The employees are pilots and the material is sexually explicit. CBC News has learned Air Canada warned pilots in its Embraer fleet at least twice last year not to leave inappropriate material in the cockpit, also called the flight deck. I am disappointed to have to raise this issue once again. The internal Air Canada bulletin reads, leaving inappropriate material in the flight deck must cease immediately. In an email to CBC News, Air Canada said the material consists almost entirely of inappropriate business cards found on flights to and from Las Vegas. But we've learned that as early as 2010, a female pilot complained about finding pornography in the flight deck and says after she raised the alarm, it got worse. In Transport Canada documents obtained by CBC News through an access to information request, the pilot claims in one picture, someone has drawn a knife in the back of the girl. The female pilot who made the complaints later took stress leave. We show Daniel Slunder the Air Canada Bulletin. He's been flying for nearly 40 years. His association represents pilots who work in the federal civil service. While there's no evidence any particular flight was ever at risk, he says... You have to pay attention to what you're doing in an aircraft at all times. And uh, reading inappropriate material is, is, is a complete distraction. And uh, things can go, can go wrong and you may miss them. The internal documents released by Transport Canada show an inspector encouraged the airline to take the problem seriously. Pilots are stuffing paper material inside compartments where electrical wiring is, and this is a hazard, not to mention that this is also a form of workplace violence. Publicly, though, Transport Canada told us it investigated and found aviation safety was maintained. After seeing our story earlier today, Transport Minister Lisa Raitt made clear her thoughts. Transport Canada has no role in it, obviously, because it's something to do with the company. But personally, I mean, obviously, it's not appropriate reading material for a pilot up front. Air Canada says it took immediate corrective action to adapt its pilot training when it learned of the problem. But even though the bulletin issued last fall warns pilots, apparently yet again, they could be fired if found out, Air Canada concedes more of what it calls inappropriate material was reported to them earlier this year. Of its roughly 3,000 pilots, Air Canada says about 150 are women. Diana Swain, CBC News, Toronto.